I'm ready for you. I'm ready, ready, ready. I'm hoping... I think I've just lost my camera. Okay. But stay there a sec. I think we're live. Lovely. Let me just check. Let me just check on the internet and it will tell me if we're both live or it's just you at the moment. Okay. The meeting will be five or ten minutes, guys. Keep your face, make tea and coffee and sign off. Great meeting tonight. This is good, Jimmy, isn't it? We are bloody... We're going around the globe. <laughs> An absolutely global. Can you hear me? I can hear yeah. you perfectly. And Nicola, can you see me? Because I can't yeah, see yeah. myself. Yeah, yeah. Just That's check great. in. Right, cool. So, give it a second. We're just gonna, I'm going to go and share this video absolutely everywhere across everyone's Facebooks really okay. far. And we are going to talk about the world of Clacton. Yep. Jay Wick. Everything about Danny Sloggett. And, not everything. Um, not everything. Not, not everything. <laughs> we're all, all we're right, so we're... a dark horse in a crowded street. <laughs> right. So, for anyone that doesn't know, um, Danny yesterday went live um, with me and Jimmy, who's also in his camera shot at the minute, to promote We Love Clacton, which is a community Facebook page to help businesses. There you go, Danny Sloggett Vision, to help people get more, um, to get kind of more coverage in the area and stuff like that. So as it's normally um, Mr. Danny Sloggett doing the interviewing all the time, I thought I would interview Mr. Danny Sloggett. So it's roles reversed. So Good I'm luck. just going to put a notification <laughs> up on everyone's screen. As it's everyone can man. see now, there's a big notification at the bottom that says start sharing. Anyone who's watching right now, there's a few people watching, start sharing. I'm sure because Danny's on this, a lot of people are going to start watching anyway. Um, Danny, tell me why... Tell me everything you love about Clacton, mate. I moved to Clacton in 1979 when Butlins was still open. I remember seeing a million people a year coming to Clacton. I remember the whole of the seafront full of motorbikes and scooters and bikers and mods and characters and punks. It was so much going on when I was a kid. And I said, I can't wait to grow up. And I renamed Clacton. I called Clacton the Costa del Clacton. And that was from the age of four, back in 1979. Nothing's changed. My love is forever. I really do love Clacton, as much as I really do love Jaywick, as much as I really do love everywhere. And my love is so much that I should have been writing songs. But it don't matter about that. My love for Clacton is forever. Clacton is the Costa del Clacton to me. Best beach, best people, best shops, best places. What more can I say apart from shine on Clacton? <laughs> so, um... Jay Wick has been in the news a little bit today. Well, actually yes. been in the news a lot. Um, old Mr. Donald Trump. He should come to Jay Wick before he says things about us. Yeah, I, bet, I reckon he should, mate. I think he should, because he would actually use a photograph from today, not from five years ago. How, yeah, how old is that photo? That is about five years old. And, like, we call it politrix, not politics. You call it what, sorry, mate? Politrix. Oh, I like that one. Yeah, because most people call it politics, but I call yeah. it politics because they make our money disappear and they don't actually do anything for anyone apart for themselves. That is what I think. I agree. So, um, obviously, I saw your live video earlier. You were talking about your guy that lives in a shed. Yes, he, he's here now. He and there is a, there is a lot of people. As it, yeah, because it's obviously a big... We Love Clacton is obviously a community Facebook page. Yes, and I'm, He's part of the Clacton community. He so sure is. It would be a really good idea to get a good under... Turn the camera up a little bit so it's looking at your face, not your chin. Um, that's it. So it would be a really good idea, mate, if we could just... Uh, like You could just quickly say hello to him on the camera so people can get an understanding. Can we that, do that now, yeah? Yeah. In 2018, mate, there is people currently... Oh, just lost him. He's just going to go find someone. <laughs> um, it's just gone to get him, Jack. Lovely. Right. right, if anyone on here... Right, we're going to change camera, man. Now this man needs a rest. Thank you, Kevin. Shine on. One second. Oh, Jimmy's going to do it. We are blessed. Right, Scotty, do you want to say over there? Thank you. Just hold it high. Like that. Yeah, high. And try and get the whole of the room in the background. Hold it high and you're blind. And just keep it. And hold it with a bit more of a grip. We can't be losing this. Get, get a grip so it's held. Like that. With love. That's it. And hold it like that. Got it. Keep it there. Do not move there, please. Right, lovely. Where's AD? AD, I need your brother. Here he comes, my brother from the, the man in the shed. And he'll tell you why he doesn't... Where are you? Just so everyone knows, mate, where are you at the minute? 
I'm at St. Christopher's Church in Jaywick, and I run the Jaywick Sounds Happy Club, which I created to give Jaywick a voice. We have a meeting every month where I ask all the residents things that are concerning them, then I send an email to the council, they send me a reply and tell me all the things that they're doing in Jaywick, and they tell me why. It's a great arrangement. This is my man, so Aidy. AD has been forced to live in the shed until he gets a place in Jaywick. He wants a place in Jaywick because he doesn't want to be around people that don't want to improve their lives. So he's determined to stay in Jaywick. Have you got anything to add to that, AD? Yeah, yeah. Mainly, my reason, of course, I'm, I'm determined to stay in Jaywick. It's this, this is my life. This is my community. This is, yeah, this is my life. Really. You love that, Tim? Yes, it gives me extension of gratitude, but the only problem is I don't want to accept the place there because I don't want to be wrapped around people from my own life. I gotcha, yeah, I totally which, understood. Which included like, drugs, crimes, and all that. I understand. And, and despite the fact that I live in a shed, I'm quite, I'm, 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 You'd rather I'm, live in a shed than go back to Clapton and yeah. your old habits. Yeah, I think. I, I think respect I, you for that. I think I'm allowed to be proud of myself. Like, uh, yes. Like, I've turned my life around with the help of. Well with, done. Again, with the help of the Jamaican people. And so. Well, you are a Jamaican person. Yeah. You are heart is here. Exactly. So, Clapton, Jamaican, we are one. And so, together we shine on. You're in the Costa del Jaywick. Yeah, exactly. And look, if, if it means riding it out, do you know what I mean, in, in the shed, so be it. But I am determined to yeah, get a place in Jaywick, do you know what I mean, ASAP. I'll make you right. Yeah. Is there anything you'd like to ask, Lady Wise, here quickly? So I know that um, Jimmy come and saw him earlier and donated him some bits and pieces. Um, you love you, man. Yeah. yeah um, I'm gonna I'm gonna arrange to see Jimmy probably tomorrow, and with the We Love Clapton page, he's gonna come and drop some bits off as well. Oh, come and help you out. If there's anything you specifically yeah, yeah. need, just let us know, mate. Listen, everyone does, yeah. everyone needs a bit of help. I've needed help in the past, yeah, people yeah. Me, so I'm sure people will do the same for you, mate. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, here on the We Love Clapton page is that it's a community, it's, it's community events, community news, and stuff like that. And in 2018, if there is a man who's living in the shed, then it deserves to get publicised. And I'm really hoping that we can maybe speak to all to work together. There must be some estate agents that have got some properties. Exactly. Yeah. Um, everyone can work together to help you out, AD, mate. All right? Yeah, okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. Man, it really does mean a lot. But yeah, yeah. We love you. Thank yeah. you for that. That's love right. you, brother. Let's stay for the meeting. The meeting's slightly in five minutes. Have a tea, got me. So you got me back again. We've got to start our meeting soon. But you can stay with the meeting, whatever you like. Anything you'd like to ask me before I get on with it? So, what's the meeting for, mate? Yes. Pardon my name? No, what's the meeting for? I know your name, Sausage. Oh, yeah, sorry, meeting I didn't hear for. you correctly because there's a lot of people talking, so it's hard to understand what you're saying. Right, the point is, I created this meeting to give Jaywick a voice. I created it in January 2016 to give Jaywick a voice. I'm fed up with people being angry about the, the stuff we live in in Jaywick. So, I created the Jaywick Sounds Happy Club. For the first hour, we play games like table tennis and all that. And then at seven o'clock, I hold a meeting where I ask the whole group, all of Jaywick, things that have happened in the last month, things that concern them. And then at the end of the meeting, I send what I've written down on my back of my book to the council. The council then send me an email back, replying me to every question to give Jaywick a voice. And it has worked for over two and a half years now. And the people of Jaywick love it. I love it. The council love it because the council now know how people in Jaywick feel rather than them guessing or assuming they now know exactly what is going on in Jaywick from the people that live here daily. And that is the whole point of the Jaywick Sounds Happy Club. It has purpose. It makes people happy. People gather. It's like an adult youth club for adults. And it's a lot of lonely people in Jaywick. And it, I think everywhere could have a happy club, not just Jaywick. Clapton, Colchester, everywhere could have a happy club. So, Danny, thanks for your time. Thank you, you legends. And you, mate. As you like to say, Danny, go shine on. Shine on, and I can't wait. If you're coming to Jaywick tomorrow, let me know. We'll meet up together, yeah? Yeah, I'll give Jimmy a bell, and whatever. I'm sure we'll, I'll try and get it. If not, it'll be Saturday morning. Um, but hello, Jim. So, guys, listen, the whole idea of this is that each a few times a week, in each evening, we're going to live on We Love Clapton. Sunday, yes. we're talking to community people like Danny. Sometimes we'll be talking to business owners like Jim. And sometimes we'll just generically be talking about stuff that goes on in and around this lovely place. So, thanks for watching. Everyone, my and share this video. And if you haven't already, make sure you follow Danny's um, YouTube account because he releases 
videos about the town all the time. And also make sure you search We Love Clacton on Facebook. So just search We Love Clacton and it will take you straight to our Facebook page. Press like and you'll get to see all the information. Cheers, Keep guys. We love you and we love Clacton. Shine. See you soon, fellas. Shine on, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> we love you.